So here's the first starting location that I have found in Spy Academy. Take a look at your map. We're going to zoom right in here so that you can get your bearings right here. You're going to touch this little door and it's going to open and it's going to say starting location unlocked. I'm going to back out a little bit so that you can sort of get a bit of an idea as to where this is. Because it kind of took me a moment when I was running around through the stairs and all that. So if you can find this little water fountain thing right here, which that shouldn't be an issue. Again, it's right there. So this one seems a little bit tricky as you zoom into your map and you watch where I'm physically standing right now. All right. I'm around here. This can be a little bit confusing, especially this level. A lot of verticality. You're going to see a door up ahead that you can pick. You can jump over here. Drop down. And click on this door and that will unlock your starting location. Now there's a way for you to come on the beach over here. The problem is I don't know if you can unlock it from this side. You see me on the beach right here. So I can't confirm whether or not you can do that. You can try and see if it works. If not, you'll have to take the route that I just showed you a moment ago. And here's one of the work benches right here. Let's take a look at our map. Let's zoom right in, right inside this little square room. You'll either need the armory key or a satchel. I found the armory key on the guy somewhere down over there. Anyways, here's the door here. And here's where I'm at right there. For this workbench, let's take a real close look at where we are here. We're going to zoom in nice and slow. Because this took me a while to find. Okay. The workbench is over here, but you need to be standing on this street. Find a way to get over here. And this building here is what's right in front of us. You're going to see a red car. Now, there's a red car up there somewhere. That's definitely not the one. You need the red car that's around this big building with like a little underpass. Once you see the red car, hopefully you've been working out a bit. Jump up here. And this, I believe, is the SMG workbench. And there you have it for this one. Better I take my sweet ass time to show you how to do this so that you don't get lost. So first of all, let's take a look at where we are in Spy Academy here. You're on your way to exfiltrate the fuck out of there. This building behind us over here is where the last workbench is. So now that we've got our bearings, okay, and you would be ready to go down there. Okay. We're going to look back at this building and we're going to start to slowly backtrack. We want to make our way up there. And how we do that is by climbing a bunch of vines. Again, let's take a look at the map as to where I am now. Even getting to this point, to be honest, can be a little bit tricky, but this isn't supposed to be like a, a complete how-to now. If you can't get through the level on your own, I am not good at doing tutorials. I'm more about here's where it is versus how to get to that location in complete depth. And I do not know if there's any other way to reach this place. I really just don't know. So there it is. 
Let's uh, kind of look around for a bit. It's one of those things where even if you could be on the other side of this door, you wouldn't be able to open it because you'd have to be on this side. Yeah, I've actually been down that staircase before. Yeah, that's right. So I, I believe that is the only way that you can get up here. And again, you could kind of see where we were. We went over that bridge. Is he still alive? Anyways. All right, so that's it for that.